depending where you're at, good morning, good day, good night. I hope you guys are staying busy, uh, but also staying safe. Uh, in this video today, we are going to be looking at a meat share. Uh, what is a meat share? It's basically a group of people going in on a carcass. Uh, it could be lamb, uh, beef, pork, and getting an equal uh, amount of meat out of it or to their share. You can usually buy a whole share or half a share, quarter share. Uh, it depends on the rules of, of uh, the agreed upon meat share, that is. So what we're gonna do is go through uh, a lamb share that I have just done in the past couple weeks. And this is one way that you guys can do it. The benefit of this is basically buying meat in bulk um, for your freezer. Uh, it's much more economic. Uh, you're gonna save a lot more money. In this video, I am uh, a share participant and I'm actually the butcher. I propose that my share just be covered or, absor or absorbed by the other shareholders uh, for my butchery work. Usually I would do maybe like 25 or $30 an hour uh, breaking it down if I wasn't a shareholder, but uh, I wanted to make a video on this lamb so I wanted to take my time on it and I didn't want to run the clock up or anything. So uh, it worked out nicely. They did indeed cover my share and I did all the butchery work and I made a video of the uh, lamb breakdown I did and now I'm doing a video on the lamb share. Let's take a look at the uh, small animated video that uh, I put together for describing the lamb share. Hope you enjoy it. So this whole lamb came in weighing at a total of 68 pounds at $4 a pound. That came out to $272 in total. We split this up into four shares of 17 pounds costing $68 a share. Now that is without a butcher fee incorporated in. That's really up to the butcher and what he deems worth it. Let's look at our shareholders. We have Sarah, Charlotte, Seamus, and Theo. Since Charlotte looks so excited about life, we will make her the host. The host has a few job details. One of them is to collect the money from the participants and make sure it gets to the farmer. Once that is done, the host will assign everyone a number and use a randomized process like picking numbers out of a hat to decide the round robin order in which the participants will choose their cuts of meat after it's butchered. In the most recent share, we used everyone's favorite sidekick, Bogey the Dog. In each of these socks, there is a name and the order in which that guy selects them is the order in which we will pick on Sunday. This guy, socks, Yeti Cooler. All right, here we go. Once the lamb is cut up, wrapped, labeled, and weighed into roasts and cuts, the participants will choose one package per round. We utilize the Zoom platform since we couldn't be together in one place due to quarantine. And also use Zoom during the breakdown for participants to call in, see the process, and ask questions. The host will keep track of the weights each individual has on an Excel format or piece of paper until the, their share weight is reached. At this point, I will give my best advice on how to cook and utilize each piece and help the participants choose what cuts they want to add to their shares. The only thing we left for the end was divvying up the bones and fat. We did our best to divide into four equal shares and then each participant got a package. After all the shares had been chosen, we transported them in styrofoam containers to one of the participants' homes, and everyone was able to stop by in a social distancing way to pick up their share. All right guys, so we have uh, broken down the lamb uh, share video. Uh, I hope that has helped. You can definitely replicate this uh, for beef, pork, goat. Uh, you know, the huge benefit of this is uh, supporting your local farmer, uh, getting to know, you know, the community of like-minded people. Um, like I said before, it's, uh, you know, super economic, um, filling up your freezer with high quality meat. 
Uh, this is what I love to do. I, you know, I, I got a huge chest freezer uh, and a regular freezer filled with quality meat, uh, always on hand. If you guys have any uh, questions or comments or anything, you know, comment below. Uh, if you like this video, subscribe. I got a lot more content coming out. Thank you.